friends in this video we'll discuss class 10 chapter 3 exercise 3.5 question number 3 2 3 and 4 so we'll solve this question by using cross multiplication method in my last video i have already discussed about the cross multiplication method if you have not watched that video you can go to the i button and you can watch here first equation is 4x minus 3y equal 23 so 23 in the right side so i have to bring in the left side so this is plus if you bring this side it becomes minus 4x minus 3y minus 23 then here equal 0 so equation 1 next second equation 3x plus 4y equal 11 now this one you have to bring in the left side so 3x plus 4y plus 11 if you bring this side becomes minus 11 equal 0 this is equation 2 now we'll use cross multiplication method in cross multiplication method we'll start from y coefficient y coefficient is minus 3 so minus 3 then constant is minus 23 then x coefficient is 4 4 then again at y coefficient minus 3 similarly for second equation y coefficient is 4 so right here 4 then constant is minus 11 then x coefficient is 3 and then y coefficient is 4 next we have to use x equal y equal 1 now this to multiply minus 3 into minus 11 between minus now this to minus 23 into 4 next this to minus 23 into 3 middle minus next this to 4 into minus 11 next this to 4 into 4 middle minus next this to minus 3 into 3 and next here x minus into minus plus 3 into 11 33 minus into minus plus 23 into 4 2 then here y minus into plus minus 23 into 69 minus into minus plus 11 into 4 44 and here 4 into 4 16 minus into minus plus 3 into 3 9 and x 92 plus 33 125 then here one negative one positive what do you do we do subtract minus 69 plus 44 and if you do subtract then 25 69 is greater what sign you have minus so this will be minus 20 then here 16 plus 9 25 now, now you have to compare this two this and this you have to compare and this and this you have to compare so here x by 125 equal this it is 1 by 25 and this and this you compare 1 by y by 25 equal 1 by 25 now 125 is divide if you bring that side it becomes into so 125 into 1 
125 divide by 25 and this side same 25 is divide quad side become into so y equal 25 into what 25 so there is minus so minus 25 by 25 so if you reduce so here 25 5 is 125 so here x equal 5 and here 25 1 is 25 so there is minus so minus 1 therefore the solution is x equal 5 and y equal minus 1 next question is question number 3 here first equation is 2x plus 3y minus 11 equal 0 it is already in standard form so directly you can write equation 1 then second equation is 4x minus 3y plus 5 equal 0 it is also in standard form so directly we equation 2 now we will use cross multiplication method we will start from y coefficient y coefficient is 3 and constant is minus 11 the next coefficient is 2 then again y coefficient is 3 for second equation y coefficient is minus 3 constant is 5 x coefficient is 4 and y coefficient is minus 3 then we have to write x equal y equal 1 now you multiply this to 3 into 5 middle minus next this to minus 11 into minus 3 next this to minus 11 into 4 middle minus next this to 2 into 5 next 2 into 2 into minus 3 middle minus next 3 into 4 next we have to multiply 5 into 3 5 into 3 is 15 minus into minus plus plus into minus minus 11 into 3 30 3 equal minus into plus minus 11 into 4 44 middle minus 5 into 2 10 minus into plus minus 3 into 2 6 middle minus 4 into 3 12 next here minus 33 plus 15 1 minus and 1 plus so you subtract 13 minus 5 8 1 minus is greater so this is minus 18 so equal y minus 44 minus 10 both are negative minus 44 minus 10 both are negative then we add 4 4 plus 1 5 then you put minus sign so this will be minus 54 then here here also same minus 12 and minus 6 both are negative minus 12 minus 6 you have to add 8 middle minus 18 next we have to compare this and this and this and this now x by 18 equal 1 by minus 
18 and this and this y by minus 54 equal 1 by minus 18 you know it implies second divide divide coefficient become into so x equal minus 18 into 1 18 minus 18 by 18 and here 54 is divided what well, is that become into so y equal minus 54 by minus 18 m plus x equal minus 18 minus 18 cancel we are left 1 so this side y equal 18 into 3 54 minus minus cancel 3 so therefore the solutions are x equal 1 and y equal 3. next question is question number 3 4 here first equation is 5x plus 7y equal 19 so 19 you transpose in the left side so 5x plus 7y plus 19 if you will have become minus 19 equal 0 equation 1 next second equation is 3x plus 2y equal 7 plus 7 if you bring this side becomes minus 3x plus 2y minus 7 equal 0 equation 2 now again we'll use cross multiplication method we have to start from y coefficient so 7 and then constant minus 19 x coefficient 5 and again y coefficient 7 for second equation y coefficient 2 constant minus 7 x coefficient 3 y coefficient 2 x equal y equal 1 now you multiply this 2 7 into minus 7 middle minus next this 2 minus 19 into 2 next this 2 minus 19 into 3 middle minus next this 2 5 into minus 7 next this 2 5 into 2 middle minus 7 into 3 7 into 3 and next Here if you multiply minus into plus minus 7 to 7 49 minus into minus plus 19 into 2 38 and here minus into plus minus 19 into 3 57 minus into minus plus 5 into 7 35 5 into 2 10 7 into 3 21 next 1 minus 1 plus so we have to subtract minus 49 plus 38 9 minus 8 1 4 minus 3 1 49 is greater 49 have minus sign so minus so this will become minus 11 so here Again, 1 minus 1 plus minus 57 plus 35. Again, 1 negative, 1 positive, subtract 2, 2. 57 is greater, so minus. So here, minus 22. Next, again, 1 negative, 1 positive, so again, you have to subtract. 21 is greater, so minus. Minus 11. Now you have to compare this and this, this and this. So therefore, 
now x by minus 11 equals 1 by minus 11 and this and this y by minus 22 equal 1 by minus 11 implies this is again divide for this side become into so x equal minus 11 by minus 11 and this side 22 is divide for this side become into so i equal minus 20 21 minus 22 by minus 11 so if you reduce 11 minus 11 11 cancel it will have 1 and this side 11 to the 22 minus minus cancel get 2 so therefore the solution is x equal to 1 and y equal to 2